my ABF Renegades, what's going on? Um, so I got this program from Jeff to tell us, and I've been going over it on the podcast as of late. So um, today is today was back day, and um, I started with a compound movement with the Penley Rose. And for this program, it, it wants you to get five sets anywhere from four to eight reps. So leading up to this, I did four sets, but only I, I think with 225, I got anywhere from four to five reps. But on this last one, I decided to add 20 pounds and get the full eight reps. Um, it wasn't too much of a struggle because I've been I've been slowly increasing each week, so uh, it felt it felt kind of good. And I probably I want to say I probably could have done all five sets with that weight. Next up on the plate was seated rows. Now um, for this one, it's it's four sets and they're they're kind they're pause sets, so. Um, uh, not too not too heavy weight with this. I kind of just you know I pause at the bottom. I bring it up as you can see right there and pause at the top. It's um I tell you one thing. I, I haven't done pause sets in ages and this can this really will uh, I think it will activate muscle fibers that a lot of us don't use because we tend to uh, we tend to swing the weight um, and this this just feels really good and it's activating a lot. You can see the lats right there because there's a full stretch on the bottom. Um, and with this one, there's, it's four sets, anywhere from 10 to, 10 to 12 reps. If I can squeeze out a couple more, I will. Um, I, I'm a firm believer in, uh, you know, if you're running a program and you're able to, if you're feeling really good that day, um, and if you're able to squeeze out one or two more, might as well, it's not going to hurt anything. Prior to this set, I was using, I believe the 70 pounders. And these are the 80 pounds right there, and they felt really easy. But I didn't want to overdo it as well because I know I had I had a lot to do um, that, that today as well. I had to do chest, I had to do shoulders, and I had to touch biceps. So, like I said, just taking it really easy and just focusing on, focusing on that squeeze, which a lot of people don't do. So next up on the plate was now these these are a bitch. Um, Three sets anywhere from 20 to 40 reps. I mean, I can't remember. I don't think I've ever done um, anything above 20 reps. And when you get into the 40 rep range, it's more of a, a cardiovascular workout. So, um, yeah, these these really these killed me. Um, as you can see, not using uh, too heavy of weight, but um, just really just digging in digging deep and, and getting to it um i know tomorrow i'm gonna be sore from just just these alone um and then next up on the plate now it, it didn't film all of it but i did get to the 40 the 40 reps next up what is uh shoulder uh, some type of a compound for a shoulder same thing as as for the back with the penalty rolls anywhere from so five sets anywhere from four to eight reps and i uh I got the full eight here. It was a struggle. I haven't done shoulders in a long time since I started this, so I can see def I can see definite changes in my body just from doing shoulders. Next up on the plate was I believe I want to say lateral raises. I used the lateral raises. Up, oh, no, nope. we're gonna do chest now. I I threw in chest before the rest of the shoulders just because it's a it's a compound movement and it uh, it takes a lot of energy. And on, on this day for chest, it was it was only one exercise, but it was 10 sets of 10 reps. Um, leading up to this, I got one set with two sets with 80. I want to say two sets with 85, two sets with 90, and three sets with 95. And I decided instead of going to the hundreds, I decided to squeeze out. I believe I got 12, a good 12 reps with the 95 pounds. And everything felt really good today. Um, I can't complain uh, so far so good. Um, just tight all over, but I'm, I'm making sure that I'm stretching and rolling um, whenever whenever I get a chance. So after that, I think I believe, yep, I went back to shoulders. So with these, I've been I've been really for sh on the shoulder days, I've been really working on the uh, the outside heads of the shoulders. so this it's a lot of side lateral raises. This one was four sets. Um, 10 to 12 reps and I'm as you can see I'm pausing at the top just really focusing on the squeeze and focusing on form I just 
I'm at that I'm at that stage and, and point in my life where there's there's not any rhyme or reason just to just to swing weight and just I, I, I left my ego at the door a long time ago. There's no really reason for it. So yeah, that felt good and then um the next one was dumbbell lateral raises. Now with this it was three sets just like back with the seated rows, 20 to 40 reps. As you can see, I'm I'm using really lightweight because you have to because you have to you have to lose you have to use the lightweight to get to that that 40 mark is tough. The burn at the end of this was just incredible. I haven't when you when you go above that that certain rep range, the muscle fibers they're just engorged and they're just it's almost like I can't. I can't fully extend my arms when I'm done doing a movement like this. So, yeah, everything felt good with this. Can't complain. Like I said, I haven't done shoulders in a long time. And it just felt really good just to get back in the swing of things with uh, shoulders. You guys like my uh, Van Hulk hoodie? <laughs> it's one of my favorite hoodies. Picked up a few years back. And finally, um, biceps. Um, as you can see, here's a little physique update. Um, I'm trying to stay as lean as I can. Um, my appetite's been ferocious as of late. And on this day, it was biceps. It was 10 sets of 10. Um, so I used the... Uh, at, at By this stage, I was exhausted. Um, I got the 70 pounders. And this was my last set of 10 by 10. Thanks, guys. Don't forget to subscribe, and uh, I'll be uploading as much as I can. Thanks.